guys, it's Katie from Crafty, and today I'm going to show you how to make a DIY phone case using Oracle 631 and this month's free hand-lettered cut file from Bossy Brushstrokes. So I ordered a clear case off of Amazon, and I'm using clear because I'm actually going to put the design on the inside. And since we're using adhesive vinyl, the way that you want to do that is actually cut it in reverse. This will leave the sticky side up. So you can put it on the inside of the case so when you're looking at the case from the outside, the design will be facing the correct way. And the reason for this is because then the design won't be exposed to your hand where you're touching it and so it'll last a lot longer. And it also allows us to use Oracle 631 so you can remove it and reuse the case the next time you want to change the design. So let's get started. I went ahead and measured the phone case. We're doing our design. It's about five inches wide by two and a half inches tall. Depending on what phone you have, you'll just need to choose the correct size design for your case. So I'm using this Oracle 631 in Orchid. It's just a really pretty purple color. And like I said, we're gonna use this month's free hand lettered cut file from Bossy Brushstrokes, which I think you guys are really gonna like. So go ahead and place your vinyl on the mat. The color side goes up and we are cutting in reverse like I said so make sure you choose that mirror option when you are setting up your cut. Once the machine is done cutting, you're gonna remove your vinyl from the mat. I like to place my mat sticky side down and kind of roll it away from the design. This just helps keep everything in place. And now we're gonna go ahead and get the design weeded. We're using our crafty transfer tape. It's really handy because it has these little grid lines on it, so it helps to keep things straight. It makes it really easy to line things up. You go ahead and place that over your design. And you can use your burnishing tool to just make sure that's really good and on there. Now before I remove it from the backing, I'm just gonna go ahead and see. So I'm gonna cut it down a little bit so that when we place the design inside, I'm not having to fight with the transfer tape to get it in there. So just go ahead and cut as close to your design as you're comfortable with. Now you can see that'll fit a lot better in there and we won't have to fight with it at all to get it in. So we're gonna go ahead and take the backing off. You can see the design is now the correct way. So like I said, we're putting this on the inside of the case. So flip your case over. One thing I will say, you wanna wipe the inside of your case with an alcohol wipe or just a cotton swab with alcohol in it just to make sure there's no oil or residue, it'll make this stick even better. Line it up in here how you would like it. Once you've got it where you want, go ahead and rub over to make sure that it is all adhered. And you can see it's on here the correct way. So, Go ahead and remove this transfer tape gently. And you are going to be left with the finished phone case. How cute is that? And like I said, what's great about this is this is just Oracle 631, so it's removable. You can just peel it off when you're done. You'll be able to wipe down the case again with an alcohol swab or oh, just a cotton ball with alcohol on it to get it clean again and then you'll be able to put your next design on it. 
So you guys can download this free cut file from Arlena at Bossy Breaststrokes over on our community site. We'll leave the link down below. And we would love to see if you guys make this for yourself. So be sure to tag us at Get Crafty and at Bossy Breaststrokes. We can't wait to see what you guys come up with.